Okay, so Rekordbox has now got uh, this new auto mix feature, which is quite good. Um, background music and things like that, or if you're at a friend's house and you just want to put some music on, or if you're doing maybe a mobile party, a wedding, or something like that, and you want some background music. So you need Rekordbox in performance mode, which you can see here, rather than the export mode and you'll need the full license for that so if you've got the free version you won't be able to get performance mode you'll need to buy that <clears throat> if you've got a controller you get a code with it free okay so looking down in this right hand corner here and by the way this is the latest version of record box if you haven't got the latest version you won't have this feature click the display auto mix window on a window opens here and you literally just tra drag some tracks into it like this and uh I think you can either click this one to start playing. There you go. Okay, so that's now playing. Now, which deck are we on at the moment? Uh, we're on the left one. So you can see the end there. When it gets to that point, that's where it'll mix. So let's just skip it forward a bit. It's adjusted the BPM to match. That was a very good mix actually because it got it on the offbeat. It's adjusted the tempo back to what it was originally meant to be as well. If you want it to mix a track in quicker than just letting it drift into it, you can double click it below here and it'll bring it straight in. That's a better mix that time. If you want to save the mix, you can click the Save Auto Mix Playlist there. And it's brought it, it's taken it down there. And you can give it a name. Uh, if you want to clear it, you just press this one here. And then it'll ask you if you want to save it. If you say no, it gets rid of it. Take that off. Goes again. Obviously, this is, as you can hear from that first mix, it's not the sort, you know, it's not going to be good for professional use um, but it will be useful for the reasons I mentioned earlier so yeah it's a cool little feature